So the Miami Dolphins have added Boston College tight end Hunter Long at 81st overall in the third round of the 2021 NFL Draft. Not too shocking to pick up a tight end here because they have Mike Gusecki, who I believe is on an expiring contract, and he's going to be asking for quite a lot of money, I would assume, based on the fact that he's been probably one of the most, five most productive tight ends in the NFL over the past two years. So you can expect him to ask for a lot of money. Tight end's not an overly valuable position, though, in Miami's offense, and they probably won't be paying for that. I mean, they just won't. Or they can franchise tag him for a year, and they might go to the right with Hunter Henry, where they keep him for one extra year on the franchise tag, but then he goes in free agency anyways. So I would not expect Gusecki to be sticking around in Miami long term. They might even trade him if Hunter Long comes in and plays really well at the start of the year. But ignore the Jets sitting in the back. That's my brother's. But Hunter Long is a very good tight end. He saw a lot of targets at Boston College this past year. He was a huge focal point in that offense. I think he was actually one of the most targeted tight ends in all of college football, even more so than Kyle Pitts. You know, Grant Kyle Pitts dealt with injuries and stuff like that. But Hunter Long had a huge target share for Boston College's offense. He's a guy who doesn't have any one elite aspect to his game, but he's a passable blocker. Not fantastic in that area, passable blocker. Just enough speed to damage you. Very good at plucking the ball out of space around him, so a very good soft hand catcher. He can be able to catch some off-target throws. Should be able to create enough space for Tua Tagovailoa to target him confidently, and enough speed that he can target you and hurt you at any level of the defense. So I think this is a very good pickup for Miami, assuming that there are going to be complications down the line with Mike Gusecki and this tight end room.